A touchdown for Longview! Corey Shy, the safety, made the tackle. It's second down and for Longview at the 30-yard line of Fluffkin. I formation on second down. Two tight end offense for Longview. Under center, long count. And a drop snap from center, and Johnson's caught behind the line. Lost a couple of yards. So it's third down, and Longview needs this time eight. Well, I think just uh, early on in this game, I think you just see the quality of their, their defensive front, Brent. I mean, they are in on every play. That time, as soon as he dropped the ball, uh, Dade nailed him, even though he tried to pick it up. And he almost got the ball from him, yeah, too. They're just... Third down and eight. On view three wise, the near side of the field. Spread formation. Here, Johnson. He's going to run the quarterback draw. Up the middle he goes, and he got it to the 27-yard line. He's two, short, two yards short of first down at the 27 and fourth down. Benny Portley with a nice block, the right guard. So Longview's going to go for it. They're going to bring the big backs in. Baxter's coming in the game, along with Chris Knighton at line. So it's going to be fourth down. Longview needs a couple of yards for a first down at the Lufkin 28-yard line. Fourth and a couple of yards. Back to the wing on the near side of the field. High formation. Motion and back to the far side. They're going to give it to McCray. Left side he goes, and he is going to be close. I mean, really close. He was hit right at the line of scrimmage there by Bryson Brown, and he spun, and I think uh, he's going to end up short. The hole was there. It closed quickly, and Longview turned it over at the 27 of Lufkin on fourth down. He had a hole. He just couldn't quite get there, and then Lufkin closed quickly. <laughs> well, I can tell you, Brent, we played just barely five minutes, and uh, I can tell you that John Ty, I mean, uh, Lufkin is the fastest defensive team we, we've seen. Yeah, I mean, they, absolutely. That play right there, I thought it was an easy first, and boom, out of nowhere, the uh, tackle was made. 7 one to go, first quarter, no score in the game, three wide receivers for Lufkin. Tied in on the far side of the field. Here's Claybond to throw it. Sets up, chunks this one out. It's caught at the 35 to the 36 yard line. It is gonna be a yard it's short of a first down at 36. Horse. Coverage on the play by Boo Howard. Trey Horace with reception. He was out of the slot, ran an out route. This is nice throw and catch there. It's a good play. Second down and a yard to go with 6.38 to go first quarter. No score in the game from Lobo Stadium. Second down and one. Tied in, far side, wide receivers, two to the near side, one to the far side. There's Trevin Lewis. Lewis is going to get a first down. He wrestled his way to the 39-yard line. He got about three yards on the carry. His first Lewis down and 10, Lufkin. On the carry for the Panthers. No score in the game. Melvin Templeton, Longview's defensive end, made the tackle. That's 180-pound senior, a rover yeah, back in Longview's right. scheme. So it's a first down for Lufkin at their own 39-yard line. 6-13, the clock moves here in Lobo Stadium in the first quarter. No score, Lufkin four to, uh, three wise, two to the far side, one to the near side of the field. Tied in, Derek Lee is on this side of the field. Here's the give off to Lewis. Lewis has got a hole up the middle, he goes. He's got some room to run all the way to Longview's 35. Well, he just found a crease, and I think Longview was expecting a, uh, either a pass or something wide, and it, he popped it right inside in a missed tackle, and off he goes. He picks up uh, 26 yards. 5.51 to go first quarter. First down at Longview's 36-yard line. Up in no huddle offense. Now they've got three wides on the near side, one to the far side of the field. Here's Claybon. He's going to toss it out into the flat, and Longview with a nice defensive play, a gain of a couple of yards to the 30 to the 34-yard line. It was caught out there by Trey Horace. It's his second reception. 
first down play and ends up actually they give him a pretty good spot and well they really about did four yeah four yard gain i thought it was only a couple second down and six the clock moves at the longview 33 yard line first down in, or second down and six for lufkin 509 and the clock moves here in the first quarter Three wide receivers, too far side. There's Claybon on the keeper. Claybon is tackled by Boo Howard, but not before he got Claybon it to the 23 the yard line. It's a first down for Lufkin at Longview's 23. Chris Knighton also in on the tackle for Longview, the 235 pound senior. Brown and Chris Knighton. Well, he, he faked to Trayvon uh, Lewis to the uh, left side, pulled it out, and then went back to the right. Misdirection play and found running room and picked up. Uh, nine yards first down for Lufkin at Longview's 24 no score in the game first quarter with 444 to go here in this first quarter from Lobo Stadium wide receivers to both sides again two far side one near side now Lewis moves across Claybon to the near side Claybon's going to pump it and he's going to throw it down to the end zone it is a jump ball and it's incomplete and Addison McGee did a nice job that time by knocking that ball away yes he did I mean it was a straight up route to Casey Jones in the end zone and Addison McGee giving away a lot of uh, inches on defense. It looked like that uh, Casey Jones was gonna pull it down, but Addison McGee just stayed in there and it uh, goes incomplete. And I think he's staying down on the ground though. Yeah, he's getting up now. He was shaking up in the corner of the end zone. He got off the field, he's shaking up. They're looking at him right now. Lommy's gonna get another corner in the game and that's gonna be Aaron Hollins. Well, Addison McGee up and being uh, walking on his own power back toward the sideline, so that's good. Aaron Hollins has checked in at cornerback for Longview, and it's second down and 10 for Lufkin at the Longview 24-yard line. Two wides far side, tight end far side of the field. One near side of the field. That's Trey Horace on second down and 10. Here's Clay Bond. He's going to run it out of the pocket, and here he comes to the near side, and he gets it to the 12. And he's got a first down for Lufkin at Longview's 12-yard line. You know, Brent, I tell you, that, that's, that's a good, smart play by Lufkin because Addison McGee, the starting corner, just gone out. They bring in Aaron Hollins, and, and, you know, he hadn't played. And, you know, he was giving ground and watching receiver. Maybe they were in man. Maybe he's just not used to playing. But anyway, they go right at it with a straight run, and uh, they pick up uh, the first down. I mean, I think that's a good good place to attack when you see a guy that hadn't really played much on defense. At Longview's 12, first and 10, Darius Waters has checked in at defensive end for Longview. He is a junior. It's second, uh, first and 10 at Longview's 12. Here's Claybon. He's going to run it up the middle, and this time he is going to be hit at the 12, at the 11-yard line. He got a couple of yards. Start to 13 and got to the 11. So it's going to be second down and eight. Being stopped by Bubba Vector. Bubba Vector, the defensive nose guard or tackle for Longview, a 285 pound junior, made that play for Longview. So with 3.59 to go in the first quarter, the clock moves here in Lobo Stadium at the 11 yard line. It's second down. And Lufkin needs second nine for a first for down. Panthers. They got one, it's second down and nine at Longview's 11 yard line. They bond to throw it. They're going to whip it out to the flat. Dropped. Well, that was just a. They're going to just toss it out there and let that be a run as they, they went to the uh, receiver, Horace, and he just dropped the ball. It's, I'm not sure they had much of a play there anyway. Lobby had it pretty well defense, but he did drop it. Third down and nine with 3.33 to go in the first quarter. No score in the game. Left him with a ball with a football at Long Beach's 11 yard line. Three wise to the far side of the field, one to the near side. Laybon from the spread on third down and nine. Here he's going to pump. He's going to throw it back to the Travon Lewis, and Lewis got away and got a touchdown. Yeah, that's a good play by them. They, they faked the pass to the left. They came back to Lewis, and Lewis again. Man, I, you know. Addison McGee being out of there, and the guy that missed the tackle there, Aaron, Aaron Hollins, has played no defense to speak yeah. of all, all year, and, and it's just a hard thing to do, and they're attacking what they think 
uh, the, the inexperience is, and he missed a tackle, and Lewis takes it in for the score. It's 6 nothing Lufkin, 3.24 to go first quarter. Sterling Myers will come on to kick the extra point. Trey Horace will hold it, and Drew Alexander will snap it, snap it back for Lufkin. R.S. Hose, kick is up, kick is good. Flag on the play, and Longview, I'm certain, was offside. They were. It's a 7-0 Lufkin lead, 3.24 to go first quarter. We'll be back on 104.1 The Rats in one minute. 